Lee? Shit. I thought you were... gone. You're not alone in thinking me dead. I thought it was game over for me, too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. You heard about the heist, I take it. Must have, uh, talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Whole damn city's heard. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Hey, look. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Got a good memory for faces. Bar's closed. Sorry, Chief. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let you know you're coming. Whoa, whoa, start again. What is it you want us to do? <laughs> Jude is embarrassing herself again. Hey, where are you going? every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that clear. What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high, or sink into quicksand. Susie seems to know what she wants. Is she your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Listen, have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro.
bought some lead myself, too. Boo-hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. You do this for fun? Talking around in circles? I'm trying to make this simple. Just tell me where she is. Why can't you? I don't trust you. That's simple. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. The writing's on your face. Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk's got the address. Just take it and go. Mega Tower. Luxurious. What's clouds? A dollhouse. But can't say I like your chances if you don't know that much. Read the streets. Evelyn's there. You know this. Or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghosts before I call the girls. Hold on. A dollhouse? Evelyn a regular there? Or a drone? Exchange there with Judy. What was that all about? How's this any of your business? Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hmm. I'm true. You got any biz? Call me. Kaku Akata, the 
Lady of Westbrook When you find estate. the moment, come see me. We must settle our account. You did quite well. You and that... Until then. I see the only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. But if I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. In the tiger Let's get out of here. Together. Go figure. Every corpse plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and get soiled. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting? Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire? We find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled. And maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Two 
two matches. Interesting. Is that normal, or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. That it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Don't worry. Only two willing to spread Thank their you. legs for you. I hope you enjoy Sad. your stay. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Guess that. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be Vincent. Welp, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. I was told this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already.
silent. Why? That's tough. Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Silent. Why? Death is death is death. You're gone, game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it, and it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since, or for what's to come. What I've been through, tough to move on from that. Death was something that happened to other people. Hell, that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. <sighs> so what now? Is you're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have, you go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action, going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you. How do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? God damn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things have been going on in my head lately. This was different, refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. 
It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you, Barjan, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Ghost now, or I'll call security. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Not bad. Buddy. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dogs. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? This donk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see... VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Oh. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute.
better keep this short and sweet. Hi! Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure you're... I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Which was it? Osaka or Oslo? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Got some new hardware. <laughs> Motorcycle, not motor. A washing machine has a motor. Uh, can we?
Hey, no clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would you? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. Oh well. Can't say I didn't try playing nice. Better think real hard where you want to take this. Cause you're really starting to piss me off. Look, we can settle this without anyone getting hurt. Why make this any harder than it needs to be? You should ask yourself that. Listen carefully. One way or another, I'm gonna find her. And when I do, all kinds of shit is gonna happen. Shit you don't want to end up on the wrong side of. Assume you believe your side to be the right one. Take a wild guess. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker. She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their jobs to generate profit. Evelyn stopped pulling profit. No denying that, sadly for her. Her chip was busted up pretty damn good. By who? A client? No, outside job. Some kind of crack shot net runner. Punched through our ice like it was cheap wallpaper. The girl was a vegetable. Believe you me, we tried to fix it. Didn't even come close. They common? These kind of accidents? Ever use tech that never broke? Didn't think so. Behavioral chip splits you right down the middle. Some people plain lose their minds. And for everyone that does, there's a dozen in line to replace them. Is this you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper dog who was willing to take a look. Yeah, said he knew something or other. The Ripper. Name and address. Don't know her last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. Quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream.
Can you talk? Got a Delta. Later. A pleasant day. How's to this you. all work? The next time, an algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Got a real charm. So there'll be place. no trace of the meeting in that slimy subterranean kind of way. You're saying it's not dangerous, but so, there's some risk ready? involved. You think Fingers got her? I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't Sit be my a fucking ghost feet. on a chip in a corpse's head right now. See, your opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire'd really make this place shine. in any condition to find help. Oh, fuck! What the hell's that? No, no, damn it! Jesus, what the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommiss before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Can't find the words to describe exactly how fucked up you are. I just needed a calmer moment to think. And yeah, figured since fate gave me another shot, I'll take it. To live life to the fullest? See the northern lights? Run with the mech bulls or with gazelles on a safari? To finish what I started, I'm back in the game. Want Sokka out, so I'm gonna need you in. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel Listen, kinda honored, I actually. know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. You know you're just an irritating hallucination, right? Should just ignore you. And you're a walking corpse. Should just wait till your mind shrivels to nothing and frees up space for me. You fucking asshole. But as should be obvious, I've decided to help you. Need to find something first. Seven letters. Starts with an N.
Let's get out okay, of here. So, this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <sighs> Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside Makoshi. Okay, I'm back. Talk. V, can you talk? It is important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. gonna help us how exactly there will be a meeting you me and this friend of mine you will tell him what you told me the truth of events at the Kompiki Plaza I have little hope that he will be convinced but it will be a start Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. You sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill. Yes. Fine. Where's the meat and when? Japan Town. I'll see you there. It all the way here, huh? Must really want to talk to them. Hey, 
Hello? There's a line. Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Fingers guy, you know him? Heard some things, yeah. Something around like his hand sometimes slips. What are you even doing here, Judy? Same thing as you. Looking for Evelyn. How'd you know to look for Evelyn here? Got friends at Clouds. Word spreads out of there quicker than the clap. Meaning? Friend told me what you dug up, so here I am. After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the mocks for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell she go back to Clouds? Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. This friend of yours, who is it? Tom Caldera. Works as a doll there. Never bothered to mention Evelyn had disappeared when we talked. And then you came around asking questions. Got him scratching his head. Didn't strike me as the brightest bulb in the batch. Sorry, but right now, I could give a shit about what does or does not strike you. Let's just concentrate on finding Evelyn. I'm starting to get worried, seriously. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docs in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. I think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere. On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God, no. Because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. She means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how, exactly? The moment you knew where she was, you sprang into action. Once you get close to Evelyn, you never want to let her go. You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew.
You see a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here? No idea. Gotta ask him. I need to talk to him. It's important. You think we're just here to polish our nails, huh? I'll let you yeah, cut in front of me. You're a real pain yours. in my cleat, Mitzi. You know that? And you might as well hmm. knock and find out when he's mopping up. Now? Supposed to be a goddamn yeah. clinic. Wait, not in any of your blonde Go on now. Don't floor. you worry about her. Faceplate's previous owner had a longer face than you. Come on, let's go. Edges are stretching your optic. Don't worry. Your eyes I think he's are done. Dust. We're going in. do for you. Need a minute of your time. A minute? That's all? Shame. Could watch those juicy lips of yours flap for hours, days. <laughs> But I'm busy right now. You tiger claws! As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the mocks. The mocks? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? Evelyn Parker. I need to know where she is. Step into my office. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be. I'll be more than glad to show you around. But, um, uh, later, perhaps. Of course, I can't remember each and every one. Please set your exquisite derrieres down. Focus V. Mox have got low tolerance for scum like you. And right now, I'm the one thing standing between you and a particularly feisty and furious member of the gang. So tell me where Evelyn is, or I'll let her talk to you. Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. Get to the point. Point. Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. You're scum. Pathetic. A waste of words. I'm a hair away from putting you down. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. Want details, damn it. Name the studio. They mentioned a moth, of all things. 
virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey, keep it together. You want to give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the death's head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. We need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh. Have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a second. Think I've got a better idea. Saw a smut shop on Jig Jig Street. All kinds of stuff there. Think you might find a death's head? I can't hurt to try. Meantime, see if I can't find something on the NCP domain. I'll wait in the van. 